Like a lot of people, we're uh, trying to overcome our overeating by uh, using the stairs instead of the elevator. I'm pretty sure they're not really balancing out on average. We're checking out this new GoPro. We're going to check the audio and video, but while we're doing it, if this turns out good, we get to show you some cool GoPro footage of this ship, which is cool. It's a little cold in here at the moment, but it's good. I can't tell you, you got your Turkish towel on. <laughs> oh yeah, Kate's got a Turkish towel. She'll be doing a full review of these Turkish towels, as was her mission, before too long. That's true. <laughs> but apparently not yet. Kate is spoiled. Thank you. What'd you get? Christy. Oh, well, apparently I'm shining this right at your chest. <laughs> your salad looks really good. Yes, it's just look in the eye. <laughs> And then I got the antipasti. All right, this is Margarita. She is our awesome server right here. Where are you from, Margarita? I'm from Russia. <gasps> Russia? Where is this? <laughs> from the Ural Mountains, right? Yeah. She's been taking care of us with water and coffee and great food. Great service. Anything you want to say about yourself? You know what I just say? Everything about me. <laughs> I doubt that. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for coming. Hello. Here, here they are. Oh, we're recording oh, you. What are we doing? <laughs> welcome, welcome. Like today, yeah? These are the folks we've been telling you about. <laughs> okay, we really hadn't said anything about it, but they're our dinner mates and they're cool. <laughs> yes, this crazy big ship we're on has an ice skating rink. Unfortunately, Kate and I are freezing just standing here watching this, so uh, I don't think we're going to do ice skating, but that is cool. Ice skating? <laughs> and there you have it. <laughs> so we're doing our little practice runs down here because the ship that we're on now is pretty much a carbon copy of the ship we're going on our Australia trip on. So we're walking around, checking out all the facilities. Just came out of the medical facility down here, which is full service emergency medical center right here on the ship. So we won't have to worry about that. We don't have a lot of emergencies. No. Just in case, the ship is really impressive. Want to buy one? <laughs> Buenos dias, good morning, and hello. Uh, we are in Curaçao. We've got a pretty windy day today. Uh, we're going to head down, head on into the town, rent a car, but uh, this coastline is just gorgeous. The downtown area in Curaçao is the next to World Heritage Site, so we'll go, we'll go over there. Yeah, there's a We'll go over there in a little bit. But now we gotta get off the ship. So it's a bit choppy today. We're at Papagayo Beach on Curaçao. Uh, as you can tell, it's kind of like a giant fenced off private beach area it's pretty down there but uh don't think we're gonna be paying to go into a to a beach so anyhow there it is we're gonna drive off to another beach in our Kia Picanto rental car so we're just driving around Curacao found the beach area not really sure what it's called thing back there and then there's some kind of ruins up there so we're gonna go check those out beach is kind of rough but the water looks nice ah! so while we're driving around over here oh we found that last bay we were at it's called Caracas Bay Ah, um, we found this neat little fort. Said it's from 1703, Beaconburg, Fort Beaconburg, something like that. It's pretty neat. I don't think this was on our tour map. 
So talk about your sketchy entrance. But the view up here is definitely worth the climb. Were you defiling a national landmark? It's not national. It's not on the registry. <laughs> So we made it to the end of Curacao. We got to where there was no more road and uh, just like a big mine and some, some farms. It's pretty arid, but uh, we're gonna work our way back and see if we can go see these Hato, is it Hato? Hato Caves. That's Clam. Bam. Bam. Caves, uh, not Batu Cave in uh, Malaysia. We'll be there next year. But uh, Hato Caves here on Curacao. We walk up this beautiful path. Looks like it's a pretty good size. According to our guide, the black up on the walls and the ceilings he is soot from the torches of the escaped slaves that used to hide in these caves. What we see down here, that was the great waterfall of the slaves. Hato caves are kind of neat, pretty small. So we can take a lot of photos in the in the cave. We've got a little bit pretty nice little steep walk out here. See if Kate falls. Don't fall, Kate. Of course, I'll try not to fall either. Especially not while multitasking. Not my strong suit anymore. <laughs> There's like some tortoises or the tortoises are brittle. Well caged of course, so we're perfectly safe. Hey guys, sorry you're in prison. Recommendations from cruise lines up top. <laughs> Currently we're trying to rustle up some street food. We got a good line on where we might be able to find some. Who knew? Somebody actually takes Bitcoin. Kind of feel like we're waking up on Christmas and finding all our presents were stolen. We found out. Big street food market, but uh, they all closed up already. So we're wandering around looking for a little bit of street food. We are determined to find something unhealthy, prepared in unsanitary conditions that we can throw on our body. I'm sure we will be successful. Well, we know it has really good local food in large quantities. We just don't know if they're still open. Maybe Christmas came again. Lots of people down here still. Wow, look at that deal. Holy cow. So look at this thing. We've got seafood rice with mussels, a little salad, some tostones, some fried plantains, and then garlic grilled corn. So we're going to tear into this. Go ahead. Ladies first, of course. Oh, that's good. Very good. <laughs> Excellent. All right, I'm going to start chowing, so I'm going to stop filming. That's really good. Tell me, guys, how are we doing? Fantastic. Del, del, delicioso, no? All right, it's a little bit. 
Yo soy de aquí, nací y me creí aquí, pero mis abuelos son de Venezuela, Maracaibo. Ah, en Maracaibo. Sí, sí el, el caracol es fresco, por eso. Sabe diferente que en otros lugares porque es muy difícil conseguirlo fresco. Muchos restaurantes lo sirven, pero son de, de viene como se dice, de hielo, ah, sí, que sí, sí. no tiene sabor. Este sí tiene buen sabor. El sabor es riquísimo. Hey, Gracias. Buen provecho. Gracias. So we just finished an amazing launch at Casa View um, that we saw. We saw it originally on a Travelista Terry. Uh, if I remember, I'll put the link to her site down in the comments. And the seafood rice. Oh yeah, really good. It had, it had mussels in it, I think. Yeah, and shrimp. Papamento means sweetheart and also like good stuff. So check this bridge out. It's a floating pontoon bridge, which is really cool. I say cool too much. It's really awesome. You probably say that too much too. It's neat. Hey, look at all those ships out there. You'd be like, hey. So as we stroll leisurely back to that, giant ship we came on. I guess all I can think of to be corny is to say so long, Curacao. It's been real. It was beautiful. That's all I can say. You notice she says it was beautiful a lot? Let's talk about animals and then we'll... Alright, animals and...